We're going to talk about all the unnecessary money I spent on clothes today. to my channel we are doing another plus size fashion video and in this video we're doing a haul and not just any haul black friday haul but low key is just a little haul because you girls on a budget i'm showing you guys all the all the things that i had picked up from the mall stuff from forever 21 h m and sephora for like the beauty knickknacks so these are things that you can find on their website. Give this video a thumbs up if you're in the Black Friday videos and you like watching people's hauls and you like my haul. And if you guys are new to this channel, hey, I'm Kay. I make plus size fashion videos and beauty related videos on this channel. So if you dig that kind of content, go ahead and click that red button down below. So without further ado, if you guys want to see all the stuff that I bought, just keep on watching. All right guys, so starting off with the tiniest bag, I got one thing from H&M and it is the, blue what's this called i don't even know what this is ah, i lost the tag it's like a navy blue i guess long duster it looks like a uh graduation gown but i don't know what it is i'm really feeling it and i'm really loving this this is something you can easily throw over like a long dress because it is a navy blue i wouldn't pair this with like a black or any really dark clothing items it's very simple but it seems very classy and like very chic i would pair like pearls or maybe dainty jewelry this was on sale for 15 dollars and then H&M had a 30% off discount. I only paid $12.09 with tax and everything included. So I just thought this was a freaking steal. Moving on to the next door is Forever 21. And whew, it looks like a big bag, but I only picked up four things. Four pretty freaking awesome things. First item that I picked up was this brown gold uh, color. Oh! oh. It's chestnut. It's called a casual jacket from Forever 21. So I'm all about having a simple outfit and then really using my layers to pull an outfit together, especially for winter, have like a black turtleneck, literally just wear all black, maybe even some dark denims, throw this on over and that, whew, that would just be an outfit itself. Originally this coat was $49.90 with the 30% off at Forever 21. I only paid about $34, I believe. A size large, which is crazy because I'm usually a Sarge Sarge. I'm usually a XL. The second item that I picked up is more of like a blush blazer. Oh my god, it's so freaking cute. This would do wonders during spring. Feminine casual blazer that I feel like would pair really easily with light denims. I'm wearing like white sneakers or white flats with them. It just gives me that casual vibe, but I feel like you could also dress this up too. Originally, this bad boy was $34.90. It was on sale for $19.90. The additional 30% off I only paid $13 for this and some change. The next item that I picked up was just a simple casual, um, simple casual, uh, <laughs> Words. Oh my god. Simple casual sweater. Casual days where I'm running errands, but I need something to, to keep me warm. I like simple things and I like little details. It's a black uh, sweater, but I love the detail down here. So this is something I would just wear with like some high-waisted jeggings or leggings or high-waisted jeans. Throw this on over and I am out the door. The final thing I picked up from Forever 21 is the top that I'm wearing right now. It's actually a bodysuit. You have no idea how much in love with this bodysuit I am. It is V-neck. I don't want to show my hoo-hahs away, so I have a black tank top underneath it. The shoulder details is what really sold me on this piece. Because it's a bodysuit, this is getting tucked into my pants. As an apple-shaped body, you know, my belly kind of sticks out. To take the eyes away from my midsection, I want them to look at something else that's more eye-catching. And this right here will do it. V-neck, it's very great on apple-shaped bodies. Fashion does not come easily to me, so I'm still trying to figure out how I'm going to put this piece together. So this is my last piece that I picked up. So non-clothing wise, I did go to Sephora. I only picked up two gift sets. Do you see how obnoxiously big this bag is? First thing was this Caudalie uh, set. I'm pretty obsessed with Caudalie Bino Perfect Serum. It's lightweight, really good for discoloration, especially if you have dark spots after acne, and it doesn't break me out. The only issue with this little bottle is that it's a whopping $79 for this little serum. Here's a tip. If you're going into Sephora and you're looking into buying, buying things, holiday season is the best time because of all the different gift sets that they have. Now, typically this bottle is $79, but at Sephora they had this set and it was $79 for the same bottle, but you also get their Vino Perfect Overnight Renewal Cream along with their concentrated essence. And then the second item that I picked up was by Fresh. Heard so many good things about it. There's not a lot of 
crap in these products, which is why I like it the most. And their moisturizer did not break me out as well. Usually the uh, Lotus Youth Preserve Face Cream is I think about $55. This whole box with one, two, three, four, five items was 60 bucks. You get to try out other different products, um, but you essentially pay the same thing for one. Look for bundles, look for holiday sets because this is where you're going to get the most out of your money. Cyber Monday is coming up. It's still right around the corner. So if you are interested in some of these clothing pieces, if you liked any of these pieces, I will do my best to find these pieces and leave a link down below for you guys to pick them up, especially for Cyber Monday. Other than that, I will see you guys next time. Bye. So, here's Panda. He's a uh, pretty big. Oh, I'm sorry. For all you cat lovers, if you guys made it to the end of this video, is this normal? This is how my cat likes to um, lay, I guess, or how he likes to be carried. He's literally like a baby. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna stop bothering him now. Bye.